Previously on The Walking Dead. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. I only need a minute. Should have put you out of your misery right then. When I look at Kenny now, he just, he seems broken. Broken people get reckless. Here. Thanks. If things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. Everybody be cool. Shut up! 
It's safe to come out. Here, I got him. Jesus Christ. That was, uh... That was intense. I thought... Man, I thought that was it. Yeah, it was for these assholes. Thanks... for coming back. I didn't know this man. I never killed someone that didn't wrong me in some way. And didn't deserve it. I tried to pretend he was a walker. He deserved it. He was trying to kill us. Yeah, that's why I did it, but I feel wrong. too much blood. Ain't nobody's fault. You know, we could have done better by her. She was just too far gone. She's with Alvin now. Yeah. Yeah, she is. Don't worry, Becca. We'll take care of your boy. You rest easy. You piece of shit! Ugh. Hey, hey! Guys, get off guys, me! Come on! It's over, man. He ain't a threat to us. How can you say that? Of course he is. Get out of the way! Oh, what are you doing? I'm doing the same thing this asshole tried to do to us. It doesn't have to go down like that. Kenny, please! He's just a scared kid, man. Kenny, his, his sister is dead. He's lost enough already. You don't have to do this. To this house, food. Please. Please, I can thank you. Bullshit! No, no. It's true. We have place. Not far. Food. See? He wants to help. Oh, don't be stupid. He's just trying to save his skin. Why the hell would you help us? Huh? I... I now want to see more people dead. Then close your eyes and I'll make it quick. Kenny, back off. If he's telling the truth, it could save all of us. And if it's a trap, we'll all be dead. We need the food. None of this will matter if we all starve to death. She's right, Kenny. We're running low on supplies as it is. It's worth the risk to check this place out. Trust him, don't trust him. It doesn't matter. We should go anyway. We just need to be careful. It can't be far from here. You stay out of this! You're the reason these fuckers came after us in the first place! Don't try and pin this on me. Lay off, Kenny. She just helped us. Look, don't start, all right? I'm sure you're real excited to have your girlfriend back. It doesn't matter why it happened. We have to move on. Think about the baby, Kenny. If there are supplies, we need them. We ain't gonna last much longer without more food. We gotta take a chance. Unless someone's got a better plan. We got something to tie this shit bird up? Yeah, I got something. Follow me, I thank you. Just give me a reason. Yeah, man, he gets it. Shots, I, I knew it was a mistake. If it helps, the thing I'd normally do is walk away for good, but I didn't. Despite what my instincts are telling me, despite everything I've seen, everything I've been through, I'm not pissed. I'm glad you're back. I didn't want you to go in the first place. Thanks. But, 
That's good. Because you're probably 90% of the reason I came back. And it'd probably get pretty annoying if you hated me all the time. I wouldn't want it to be annoying. No. That would suck. I'm gonna try to make this work. All I can do is promise you I won't abandon you again. Which, to be fair, I've never done before. Even though I probably should have. A few times now. You don't gotta point the gun at him, old. You forget what we just went through? He ain't going anywhere, Kenny. No need to get your arms. I'm worried about Kenny. He's... he's in a dark place. We gotta keep an eye on him. Everything he's been through, he's lost. It's changing him. He'll be okay. I've known him a while. Well, it's all starting to pile up. It's weighing on him. Everyone has a breaking point. You're the only one that he trusts. That he really trusts. That means you're the one that's gonna have to pull him back. He's counting on you. If we're really going to make this work, we're all counting on you. I'll do my best. I know. Come on, slow pokes! Need a second. Sorry, I just, I just put more weight on it than I should have. All right, wait there. Hey, what I say? When I tell you something, you fucking listen, you understand? Kenny, come on! There's no need for that! He's getting what he deserves. I'm fucking talking to you! I say stop. You'd best stop. If you know what's good for you. That's enough! Leave him alone! Just fucking stay put. I'm gonna have a word with Ken. He doesn't have to treat him that way. Ken's been through enough. You all right here? Yeah, yeah. Go on and talk to him. I got Clam if I need him. Okay. Here, just take the baby. Uh, okay. What do you mean? Every man I've known is always trying to let each other know how tough they are. Put them in their place. Bunch of dominant alpha male hopes shit. And it all ends the same way. Don't look at me. I ain't that guy. No, that ain't true. You get in your fair share of pissing matches too. Do I? Are you kidding me? Yes. I guess I should work on that. They're just scared. That's when it happens. Don't know what to do. <sighs> yeah, that makes sense to me. Guess it took a woman to talk some sense into him. Looks like Jane broke it up. Keep pressure on it, okay? I'm gonna go fetch some bandages. Hey, Bonnie. Yeah? I'm sorry. For what? Be right back. Damn it. How are you feeling? If I'm being honest, I've been better. Bullet in my leg. Alive. I'm 
and so many of my friends are dead. For no good reason. And I couldn't do anything to stop it. Everyone we set out with just gone. Nick, Pete, Alvin, and Becca, Carlos, Sarah. And for what? You don't make any sense. They didn't die in vain. I wish I could believe that. I could have done more. That ain't up for debate. I know it in my bones. All right, this should work. That's perfect. What a miss. Hmm? Uh, not much. You know, cleaning mostly. Trying to guess how far this place is. I need to get off this leg sooner than later. Luke's feeling bad about what happened. What? Really? But it's not your fault. Bad things happen and you can't control it all the time. She's right. You don't go blaming yourself for this. All right. Can we drop it? All right. Thanks a lot. Hey, Clem. Go over and see if you can change the bandages on Kenny's wound. I offer, but I don't think he was comfortable with me doing it. But you know him better than I do. Maybe he'll let you do it. They really need changing. Okay. Bye, girl. That's gonna sting, but only for a second. It's gonna clean it. Oh, I know what it does. It's gonna suck. It's gotta get done. I was thinking we'd go with Alvin Jr. We thought. Rebecca mentioned she'd like to name him Alvin. If it was her boy. I mean, Rebecca was so out of it she hadn't settled on her name. It seems fitting. I think his parents would have liked that. Yeah, me too. Alvin Jr. it is. Do you like that? Well, I think AJ proves. What do you uh, got there? I think I'm all right. I mentioned it earlier. The body. I told her I'm fine. I'm changing your bandage. Sounds like I don't have much choice in the matter. You don't. You shouldn't have to do stuff like this. You shouldn't have to do a lot of things.
Carver's the one who did it, not you. Is that it? Hey, I'm talking to you! What? It? It's what? What do you mean, what? The place you're fucking taking us! He doesn't speak much English. Yeah, no shit! Is that it? I thought you said it was a house! Arvo, that's not what you're taking us to, right? How much further is the house you were talking about? Answer her, goddammit! There's still more work. Some more hours. God damn it! I knew this was gonna happen! This guy fucked us! Uh, thank you. Don't mention it. It's getting dark. Maybe we should stop for the night. This is bullshit! Relax. Don't tell me to relax. He's lying. He's been lying this whole time. You don't fucking know that. I know we've been walking all day and we're still fucking nowhere. Stop fighting! Can we just try and have a calm, quiet night? Where everyone isn't at each other's throats? Please. That sounds nice. Yeah. Yeah, it does. Oh, shit. Sorry about that. It's all right, buddy. It's all right. If we're staying, we should scout this place out. All right. Y'all wait here. I'll go make sure this ain't some walker nest we're locking ourselves into. I'll go with you. I'll see if, uh... See if you can calm him down a bit. No, that's all you. Wouldn't have guessed that'd work. Me neither. I think he likes you. Calmed right down for you. That's a good sign. He's cute. Yeah, he is, isn't he? Most babies are pretty ugly this soon after being born. That's true. They usually look like weird little aliens. Here, I got him. Come on over. It's safe. <sighs> Today's my birthday. Here as I can tell, at least. Definitely this week. Happy birthday, Luke. Yeah, man. Happy birthday. Thanks. So, that makes you... what? 27? That's... that's right. I'm surprised you remember. Sure as hell feel a lot older. Don't even start with that shit. Got out of college five years ago. Feels like a million years. At least I don't have to worry about paying off them student loans. I hear that. I'm sure there's some asshole sitting on that paperwork, waiting to collect. Probably. I'd have liked to go to college. What did you study? Majored in art history. Well, 
that's cool. <laughs> Sounds like you majored in working in a coffee shop. Pretty much. Oh, stop it. You get a minor in agriculture. Keep the old man happy. Oh, I almost forgot. We're saving it for a special occasion, man. All it being your birthday and all. Figure. This is as good a time as any. Where did you get it? Bill kept all the alcohol in the armory. He didn't like people imbibing. What's that mean? Drinking. He, he didn't think people should drink. Feel a little guilty taking the first Whoa, uh... wait! You gotta make a toast. I'm not really the, uh... Come on, birthday boy. It don't have to be fancy. A toast means we all got something to drink. Oh, we can just pass the bottle around afterwards. Go on. <clears throat> to the loved ones that we've lost along the way. And to the hope that we see them again. Someday. Here, here. That was real nice. Yeah? I didn't mean for it to rhyme. That was... Well... I got first watch. I think the fence has got us pretty secure. Can't be too careful. Baby might be cold. Nah, I'll keep it warm. He's a tough little guy. You sure? Yeah. I can take it. Nah, you stay warm. Clem, let him go. I'm gonna post up over near the hole in the fence there. Holler if you need anything. Thanks, Kenny. real nice. Plenty of room if you want to get warm. Maybe in a bit. I didn't expect her to come back. Just when I thought I got her figured out, she up and surprises me. It's a good thing. Save her. is okay in my book. Well, it ain't no secret how you feel about it. Oh, come on. I'm just teasing. Ed was stupid. I understand. She's a pretty girl. Wants to get past all the dirt and guts. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to forget about all this shit for like ten minutes. Ten minutes? Man, that's longer than I'd last at this point. Hey. All right. All right. It wasn't ten minutes. Come on. We got a little one around. Sorry. Did I said anything? It's my fault for bringing it up. I know what you guys are talking about. I certainly hope not. You're talking about kissing stuff. Uh, yeah. Yes, yes, that, that is exactly it. Was there any kissing? You shut your mouth right now, the both of you. Maybe she came back for you. Could be. I don't know what to say to that. I don't know. Maybe she likes him? No, I think we could bet on that. Because you see here, Luke's a regular Casanova. Hey, shut up. Don't be modest. Your moves are working on all the ladies. Worked on me. Oh, shit. I just did it too, didn't I? Sorry, it's the drink talking. They say a drunk man's talk is a sober man's thought. Well, I ain't a man, so they can take that shit somewhere else. Clem, go see if you can get Jane and Kenny over by the fire. It's too cold for them to be out there like that. Oh, and here, maybe a swig of this will change the At least we don't need to worry about being electrocuted. They expect you to lure me over there with alcohol? 
I wouldn't have expected a bottle to last this long. It's probably been a while for everyone. Maybe I just wanted to talk. All right. I'll pretend I believe you. Even me. What's the it? You know. Yeah, because I made it with Luke. It's not a big deal. Why does this feel like I'm signing a contract or something? That's really good. Have you had any? Want a sip? It's okay. It just might burn a little. The feel it in your nose. Uh, I'm a kid. Uh. Okay then, suit yourself. I wasn't too much older than you when I had my first drink. God, I was so stupid back then. There was this time I broke into my parents' liquor cabinet and drank a whole bottle of this really spicy, sweet liquor. Oh, what was its name? I was dumb. Earthquake or something. Sounds like you were a bad kid. I guess I was. At the bottom of the bottle, there were these sugar crystals, and I got it in my head that I really wanted to eat a couple. So I got the bright idea to smash it on my parents' dining room floor to get at them. And it shattered into a thousand pieces all over the dining room. And I proceeded to eat what I thought was sugar candy. It was not sugar candy. Wow, that's really stupid. Yeah, Clem, I was drunk. The problem with glasses, it looks a lot like sugar crystals. That's never really been a problem for me. Keep it that way. My sister found me, drunk, blood pouring out of my mouth. Jamie thought I was dying, so she called 911. They pumped my stomach. I grounded for six months. Maybe you shouldn't be drinking. You're not the first one to tell me that. I haven't thought about that in a long time. A deal. Here. That guy needs a drink more than any of us. Time to not make it weird. Want to sit here? No. That's. I'm fine. Oh, yeah, okay. Wherever you like. Sorry about your sister. I miss TV. Feels like forever since we had electricity. Sorry. 
You did what you could. You tried to help, and I blamed you for it. I'm so, so sorry. You don't have anything to apologize for. I know you didn't mean it. Thanks. I miss my boy. I miss him so much. I didn't raise him like I should have. Made mistakes. Wasn't there. I thought I enjoyed that time away from him, from my family. But I'd give anything for one more second with them. Play catch with Doug. Touch Koch's face. Anything in the world. Maybe I'll see them again someday. Well, from here on out, I'm gonna try and believe that too. Right. I won't make the same mistakes again. That's a promise. You should get back over by the fire. Ain't no sense in both of us being over here. I can handle watching on my own. You should come too. I don't know. Come on. It'll be good for everyone. <laughs> Jane, you don't have to justify what I find it's best to just get this stuff out and over. Let's try. Well, that's fine. But I can confirm there was no time for kissing. chance to enjoy living. Yeah. We need to make more time for that. Alcohol helps. <laughs> Hell yeah, it does. Let me get that bottle. We got someone else that might need some help. Sounds like a waste of good rum. He lost his sister today. And whose fault was that? That makes it even harder to do. Trust me. Kenny, please, don't let it ruin a nice night. I said my piece. I don't think that boy's a bad person. I just think good people do bad things sometimes. They do it a lot more nowadays with the world being what it is. So, I think it's best Did you Sorry, okay? My fault. I shouldn't have. Leave me alone! watch. Thank you, Kenny. Really? I am. Uh, don't mention it. You did good. It was nice while it lasted. You sure you're good? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. If I if I start to crap out, I'll let you know. 
Okay, will you do that? It's no trouble. How much further? Close. Very close. You've been saying that every time I ask. Please. Come. I'm really starting to think you're <gasps> full of shit. It can't be much further. Behind you! What the fuck? Ah! 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 Jesus Christ. That was close. Fucker came out of nowhere. That was real loud. Hopefully there aren't more of them. Yeah, well, let's move. We don't want to be around to find out. It's very close. Come. There. That piece of shit? It's half built. We're here for the supplies, not the house. It's warm. Fireplace. Very warm. I'd just like a place to sit, if I'm honest. As long as there's food, who cares what it looks like? You're not gonna think that when you wake up with a couple inches of snow covering you. Are we just gonna walk over? Maybe there's a way around. I don't see any. Say it, an American asshole. It's okay. Walk. Ice. No shit ice. That's the problem. He's saying it's fine. I go first. I can be front. Maybe we shouldn't clump together. We just can't have too much weight. She's right. We need to spread out. Just to be safe. Less weight, the better. Let the Rusky go first, since he's so confident. It's okay. Okay. Don't worry. We got some walkers behind us. It's only two of them. Should be all right. Let's just get to the house. Hey, stay with us. Fuck. That's two less to deal with. Just stay spread out and we'll be fine. Hey! Motherfucker! Shit! He's gonna kill him! Kenny! Get back here, you piece of shit! I should let you drown, you piece of shit! No! Kenny! Don't hurt him! Don't come over here. Hey, I can make it. It's, it's fine. You sure? Yeah. Oh, you got walkers on the way. Let me it's help you. It's too thin for both of us. We just, we just gotta be careful. Oh, no, no! Stop! Stop! I'm fine! I'm fine! No, you're not! I just gotta pull myself out. The walkers are almost here! Hurry! Yeah, no. You ain't helping. You need to help. No! Clem, go! Go help him! No, Clem, do not! Clem, Clem do not. just go back for him! You're lying! You, you Stop do telling it. her that! Clem, look at me. Pull out your gun and shoot those damn walkers, okay? Just give me a little time. Clem, you can make it, but you need to go. No. Now! Clem, this is too dangerous. He's gonna yeah, die, I just need Clem. some more time. You guys gotta hurry! Just fall through! I can figure I'll it do out! do it, Clem! What's... Thanks. Thanks. Be on a sec, just... 
Another just like it. He wasn't lying. You want to tell me how a can of fucking chili is gonna help? How me? is beating a kid to death gonna help anyone? This is your fault, and you damn well know. Let me get a fire started. You okay? It's hurt real bad. Mike! Yeah. Yeah, okay. You got a light? I thought I had matches.
me take a look at you, kid. Jesus. He could have killed you. The fuck is wrong with him? You're up. Kenny's out back, trying to get some stupid truck started. Here, you should eat something. You okay? Thank you. I can't believe he's gone. I've lost people before, but... It just hasn't felt this... this shitty in a while. you did I'm gonna find something to clean that up thank you thank you I can't take this shit anymore feeling better yeah hell of a day but we gotta get moving if you're feeling up to it I could use a hand out back with this truck this house ain't worth a crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. With a little luck, we could get one fixed up. Be out of here by nightfall. Yeah, sure, Kenny. That's the spirit, darling. I'll wait for you out back. I'll watch him. Clem. Just be careful. What did she have to say? I know she was running her mouth. What did she say? Well, we didn't talk about you. Really? Really, Kenny. <sighs> what happened? It's over. But AJ needs us now. We gotta stick together on this thing, alright? Come on. Let's see if the truck's gonna go. Turn it? Yes. God damn it! <sighs> 
We'll get it working. We gotta get moving if we're gonna keep AJ alive. We're running out of time. I gotta get this thing to start. I'm gonna try warming up the battery. Go on inside. I don't like leaving it with that girl. Wish they'd finished this place. What are you on? I just wanted to see how you were. How do you think? It must be nice being a pretty little girl. No one ever expects you to do a damn thing. You and I both know you had a chance to save Luke. You and I both know what happened back there. I got nothing more to say to you. And Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved him in here. God damn it! Seen that look before. Son of a bitch! I'll get it. He'll be fine. Clem, he beat that boy within an inch of his life. We are way past fine. I know Kenny's a nice guy, Clem. I bet Carver was a nice guy, too. Once. Probably had a nice job, and a nice, pretty wife. Then all this happened. And one day, he caved some kid's face in and realized he could sleep at night. Kenny isn't Carver. He just made a mistake. All I'm saying is, start thinking about what happens if you're wrong. You two've known each other a long time. Sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide how much that's worth. I think it needs food or something. Seems like you've done that before. You want to try? No way. It's gonna puke. Clem, no. Hold it like this. Hey. Hi. My name's Jane. I think it's gonna puke. It's not gonna puke. <coughs> it pukes. It pukes. Gross. There's not much left. I was running with some people a long time ago, down near D.C. Some guy got trapped in the middle of a crosswalk. Can't remember his name. He used to call me Mary Jane. He was a douchebag. Anyway, the dick got stuck under a car hiding from a dozen walkers. One after another, they went down there trying to save him. Lost four people before we got him out.
So we made it? Didn't find out till later he was already bit. Turn and rip the neck right out of this old lady. The look on her face was... She was just staring up at the sky, like she was watching a bird. Look, Clem. better talk some sense into him. For his sake. scared of more than me. Did you hear me? We're all scared. Look, we got maybe a day's worth of food for that kid left. That's it. Clem, think about Rebecca and Alvin. I mean, what if Lee hadn't gone tearing across half of Georgia looking for you? A lot of folks died to make that happen. A lot of folks died to get us this far. We owe it to them to see this done. This is different. How? Where are we gonna find baby formula? I don't know, but sitting around here ain't a way. <sighs> I wish Lee was here. What'd you think he'd say? I think he'd tell me to try to keep the group together. And that we should stay away from 
cities. We can't just give up on this kid. I mean, what's the point of going on after that? That's what people like Lee knew, and what people like Jane won't ever understand. Look, I know Wellington might be bullshit, but where there's smoke, there's fire. Krista heard about it too, right? You know, when I first saw you back at that lodge, I thought I was dreaming. And when you sat down next to me and we shared that meal, well, I could tell that you were different now, grown up. I felt pride, a pride I hadn't felt in a long time. But I need you now, Clem. There have to be folks doing better than us. It's the only chance that child has. Something has to be out here. We'll find it, Kenny. I knew I could count on you, Clem. Look, we'll figure everything out in the morning. Come on, let's get some sleep. So we gotta be ready.
Back to house. 
Carver's camp? The fuck kind of plan is that? I think Bonnie said there was more formula back there. And we actually know where it is. And it was overrun by a damn herd. The walkers should be gone by now. It's miles in the other direction. Wellington's out there. We have to keep looking, Jane. Clem, you can't be falling for this. She made up her mind, Jane. Clem, please. This is suicide. Why don't you let her think for herself for once? Why don't you? Me? Look, even if there is some place up here, it could take us weeks to find it. We could get back to Howe's in a day. Tell you what, we could turn around just as soon as you cry this wheel from our cold, dead fingers. How's that sound? Whatever. I give up. Get your feet off the dash. Let's play a game, Clem. I spy, with my little eye, an asshole. Your turn. Grow up. Go to hell. I'll pull this fucking car over. Go ahead. You wanna die out here? Better than waiting to die next to you. We're both being children. Me? I couldn't see the damn road. Bet you're having trouble seeing a lot of things these days. You shut your fucking mouth. I am done playing games with you, Jay. Fuck you. You don't know a damn thing about me. Oh, I know exactly what you are. Nothing. Nobody cares about you. And you don't care about nobody but yourself. That makes you nothing. What is it with you? It's your family, right? Don't. It is, isn't it? I'm warning you, you little shit. You're just another type A asshole trying to save a bunch of dead people. Don't you fucking talk about them. Shut up, both of you. Stay out of this, Clam. Don't tell her what to do. You listen to me. You mouth off about my family, and I will fucking end you. Jesus Christ, I'm so sick of this wounded warrior crap. Just pull over. I can't take this. What? Running away again? What a fucking shocker. In the end, still only care about yourself, right? And where were you when Sarita died, Kenny? Huh? Where were you? I was there. I couldn't. God damn you, I love that woman! Who could love you? Look at you. You can't raise this kid. It's scared to death of you. I got this way, saving your ass from that hellhole. And I would have left you to rot if I'd known what you were. Nobody who died is anyone's fault. We, we all wanted to be together, and it just went bad. We owe it to them to try to make the best of this. I'm sorry, Clem, but I can't put up with this bullshit anymore. Oh, the feeling's mutual. You know the thing about people like you, Kenny? You're just a bomb waiting to go off. Everyone talks about you behind your back because they're afraid of you. That ain't true. Mike, Bonnie, Sarita. Fucking liar, that ain't true. Everyone around you knows that sooner or later, they're gonna end up dead. Sarita knew it, I know it, and so does Clementine. I told you not to talk about my family! Fuck you! Fucking piece of shit! Go to hell, you son of a bitch! Jesus! You okay? I'm fine. How's AJ? He's fine. You sure? Yes. Clem, you alright? Yeah. Penny, I'm... Wait, hold on. Go around. One of them might have diesel. We shouldn't stop here. We're running on fumes. Got no choice. When I holler, it's okay. Drive up closer. Anything happens, I'll try to meet you there. All right? If you're going, go now. Kenny. That fucking asshole. God. I can't do this anymore. I'm serious, Clem. I tried, but I just can't. Stop making him mad. Everything makes him mad. How are you not seeing that? Well, all you're doing is just making it worse. You're just like him. Clem, we could leave. Right now. Are you serious? What about AJ? Look, I, I know you're close to him, but Kenny would never let him go. This is our chance, Clem. Don't you ever want to know what it's like to live your own life? It's snowing. Why are they moving? They must not be cold enough yet. Fuck! Get us out of here! I don't know how to drive! See that pedal on the floor? Step on it! Don't just sit there! Hurry! Get out! Tell 
Kenny! I 
surprise. And then you... You didn't have to kill her. You didn't have to kill Jane. It was me or her, Clay. She was trying to kill me, too. If she had lied about it, I wouldn't have went that far. I just... Why would she... She was nuts, Clay. A disturbed person that had her own agenda. And was looking out for herself. Listen, I didn't want that to happen either. I thought she killed Alvy Clem, and at any point she could have stopped what was happening by saying he was fine. She wanted to fight. Never, ever hurt you. You understand? I was protecting you. You believe me, right? Just imagine what she did to Alvy. Everything just went by. By the time I got my head straight. Me to hold him? Nah, he's still light. We're fine. Come on, I'll race you to the top. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Come on, Alby, we got this. You cheated. Clementine. Hello. Oh, what a handsome boy. Look at him. What's his name? Alvin. Junior. Oh, he's gonna be a little heartbreaker when he grows up. Is there someone named Krista in there? I don't think so, dear. So, this is Wellington, right? A lot of people call it that. Okay. So, what do we do to get in? Well, I'm afraid this is the part where I give you the bad news. What the hell's this? That's some supplies. Food, water, what? some medicine, a first aid kit. Why are you kit? giving us this? Unfortunately, our community isn't accepting our members. We're over capacity as it is, and there's just not enough to go around if we keep bringing people in. 
things might change in you a few months. You fucking kidding me. I'm sorry. I really am. So we're supposed to just take this and go? But, but we have a baby. This, this is hard for me too. I don't want to turn anyone away, especially children. But just take the kids. What? Please, just take the kids. It's too dangerous out here for them. Kenny, I. It's just a little girl and a baby boy. You can make room for that. You can take back the supplies you gave us if that helps. Please, just. I need them to be safe, and it's safe in there. I know that. Just ask someone, please. They won't make it out here. Please. Stay safe out there. 